welcome to another Science in Minutes. I'm the science teacher, Mr. Hall, and this is my special guest. Hi, my name is Jennifer, and I'm in sixth grade. Sixth grade, all right. So I, I thought, I, I saw Jennifer's water bottle, and it reminded me of uh, something that's important to know about in science, and that's a vortex. So what is a vortex? A motion of fluid around the common center line. Objects are pulled towards the center. Speed increases and pressure decreases in the center. That was very scientific, right? So something whirls around and it gets faster and faster, right? Yeah. So um, what are some common examples of vortexes you see in, in nature? Whirlpools, tornadoes, hurricanes, and galaxies. Very good, even galaxies are vortexes, right? So anything that's going around is center point, right? Yeah. And so you can see a vortex every time you flush the toilet, as silly as that sounds. Yeah. So I noticed that uh, Jennifer's bottle was really cool. So I, I've got this little toy called a tornado in a bottle. And so if you shake it up, you can create a tornado inside this. So they created this, this vortex shape in there. If you do it right, it'll, it'll go around. See that? And I realized that Jennifer's water ball does the same thing. Let's come on a little closer and let's check it out. So if I twirl this around, I can get a good tornado going in there. See that? See that vortex happening? And it keeps going and going and going. And you can see it down there. Just get it going. and. So that's a vortex in a bottle. You don't have to actually have to have the toy to get it to work. Now, of course, it has to be a clear thing if you want to see it. See how it spins? And the more it spins, the faster it goes down towards the center. See that? So vortexes are, are pretty common in nature, and uh, they're all around us. So thank you for, uh, for bringing in your water bottle and helping us out today. And science is all around us.